Hi everyone! Today we have a Christmas Play-Doh challenge! What are we going to make? Oh wow! We're going to make a gingerbread house! Here's my gingerbread house design! Now, I'm going to use brown Play-Doh to make the walls and the roof of the house! I'm rolling it out really flat! Now, where's my design? Here it is! I'll place it down on the Play-Doh and cut around the edges! Very carefully, I'm cutting on a diagonal down the roof. And the steps. And over here, nearly done. All finished. Now I'll remove the excess Play-Doh around the edges and peel away the pitcher. And now for the fun part. We can start decorating our gingerbread house. First, I'm going to make some candy cane. I'm using this white Play-Doh. I'm rolling it out into a long cylinder shape. I've already made these long red spaghetti shaped pieces out of Play-Doh. And you'll see that I'm placing them all around the sides of the white Play-Doh we made. That's two pieces. Three. And four. And now I just twist it a little, just like that, and roll it out carefully. And watch, you'll see it get longer and longer. Twisting it around. Roll it out some more. It's starting to look like candy cane, isn't it? Nearly done. Let's take a look. Oh, wow! We made Play-Doh candy cane. Now let's go add it to our house. I'll place a little bit here. it here and some along here at the bottom of the house that looks about right and I'll place some candy cane here what do you think it's starting to look quite good and I'll put some here on the left side and another candy cane on the right. Great! What's next? Hmm, how about the window? I'll just place it here and peel away my picture. I've already placed the frame of the window on here and here's some snow on the windowsill. Now I'll put the window frame in using black play-doh. That's a vertical frame, now the horizontal one. Looks awesome! Now I'm going to make the door. I think I'll place it just here. Peel away the picture. I've chosen red for the door. And I'll place my other window right here. I'll just remove the picture to reveal the blue glass underneath. Now I'm going to add the window frame. That looks about right and some snow on the windowsill. All I need to do now is add the final touches to the window. I'll use some candy cane for around the door. I'm bending the Play-Doh to make an arch shape. I just need to press it down a little so it stays in place. And I'll cut it right here and stretch it out a bit so it keeps its shape. Now for the steps. The two steps have snow on them. I'll place the door handle here. And now for the roof tiles. Here's the pink layer. Now for the purple. This is going to look so pretty. Add a blue layer. Now green. What comes next? Ah, that's right, yellow. It's looking good. Now for the orange tiles. And last, some red tiles. We've given our gingerbread house a rainbow colored roof. What's next? How about I place snowballs all around the roof frame? 
Looking good! And now I'll place some white snow across the top of the roof and down the side. And place another row of snowballs right here. Fantastic! Oh, this will look great at Candy Cane's circular window. The last thing I need to do is decorate the chimney. We've made the chimney and we've completed the gingerbread house. Looks amazing! Thanks for helping me. See you next time on Rainbow. Welcome to our toy food kitchen. Here's our first customer. She would like a strawberry cake for a birthday tea party. Can you help me find the strawberry we need to make the cake? Here's our first piece. Now, where's the second piece? Hmm. How about... Oh, down here on the right. Let's see if it fits. It does. Strawberry. Let's put it back into the puzzle. It belongs right here. Oh, wow. We have our strawberry. Let's go make our cake. Now, I'll just slice it in two halves. And I'll get my bowl. And place your strawberry in the bowl. That's one, two. What else do we need? Hmm, maybe a little bit of sugar. I think that's enough. And some flour. What else? Oh, some milk. And I have a carton of eggs. How many are in there? There's six eggs. Which one shall we pick? How about this one at the back, the pink one? Ooh, it's all gooey inside. Great, that's one egg. And the last ingredient I'll use is some strawberry yogurt. Now, the next step so I'll get my mixer and mix the ingredients. Turn it on. Oh look, you can see the ingredients mixing together. Nearly done. Turn the mixer off. Let's take a look at what we have. We have our pink cake mixture. Now all I need to do is press it into the shape of a cake. Next, I'll cook it in my toy oven. Close the door. I can see it's starting to cook. Oh, wow! Look at that! We made a giant strawberry squishy cake. Oh, I can't wait to show our customer. Now I'll just put it on this beautiful pink plate. Let's go take it to the counter. One strawberry squishy cake. The cake costs five coins. Let's count how many coins our customer gave us. That's one coin, two, three, four, and five. Great counting! Here's our next customer. He would like an avocado sandwich. Can you help me look for the avocado? Okay. Oh, I found the first piece. Let's go find the other half. Hmm, maybe it's over here. How about up here? Oh, I think I found it. Let's see if the two pieces fit together. They do! Avocado! Now let's put it back in the puzzle. Oh wow! We have our avocado. Let's go prepare it in the kitchen. I'll just cut it in half. Great! We have some avocado slices. Now, I'll just get out this red tray to make our sandwich on. I have two slices of bread. They have sesame seeds on top. Now where's my avocado? I'll place it right here. And what's next? How about a slice of tomato? Hmm, what else? Ah yes, an onion ring. Hmm, how about a slice of cheddar cheese? And, oh I know, some lettuce. 
And don't forget the cucumber. I have some mayo. How about we put this on top? Great! And add some mustard for some extra flavor. <laughs> I think that's enough ingredients in my sub sandwich. I'll just put the top on. Oh, look how many things are inside the sandwich. Let's go serve it up to our customer at the counter. The sandwich costs three coins. Our customer gave us these coins. Let's count them. That's one, two, and three. One sandwich coming right up. Our next customer would like some banana pancakes. Can you help me find the banana? Oh, I've already found one half. Now, where's the other half? Not here. <gasps> here it is. Let's put the pieces together. We did it. Banana. All I need to do now is place it into the puzzle. Oh, we have our banana. Let's take it to the kitchen. I'll just cut a slice. Great! Now all I need to do is make the pancakes. I'll just place the pancake pan on the ground. And I think I'll just put this little dab of butter in the middle. Oh, I can hear it sizzling, can you? a jug of pre-prepared pancake mixture and I'll just place it carefully on the pan. Now let's watch it cook. Oh, I can see it bubbling. All done. I'll just flip it over. It's a little tricky. Oh, we did it. Now all I need to do is serve it up on the plate. Whoop. <laughs> There you go. Now let's decorate the top with the banana slices. That's one, two, and three. Oh, and how about some chocolate chips in the middle? Just put it on my pink plate and serve it up to the customer. Let's take it to the counter. The pancakes cost six coins. A customer gave us these coins. Let's count them together. One, two, three, four coins, five, and six. Banana pancakes coming right up. Here's our next customer. He would like a tropical fruit smoothie. Can you help me find the star fruit? I found the first half. Now where's the second half? Not here. How about over here on the left? Oh, I think I see it. Do you? Let's see if they fit together. They do! Star fruit. Now let's put it back in the puzzle. Uh, it goes right here. I'll just take it to the kitchen and start making the smoothie. First I need to cut it in half. That's two slices. Let's put it into the blender. That's one. And two. And let's look for the second tropical fruit. Durian. Here's one half. Now where's the other half? Is it over here? Hmm, maybe down here. Here it is. We found it. Let's put the two pieces together. Durian, the king of fruit. Now where does it go in the puzzle? Right here. I'll take the durian to the kitchen and add it to the smoothie. Cut it in half and put it into the blender. And look for one more piece of fruit. This is papaya. Can you help me find it? Here's the first half. Now where's the second half? Maybe over here. Here it is, down here. Let's put the pieces together. Do they fit? They do! Papaya! Now let's go put it in the puzzle. It goes right here. Great! We have our papaya. Now let's go to the kitchen. Now I'll just cut it in half and add it to the blender. That's one, 
and two. Oh, I think I'll add some pineapple. That will go great in the tropical smoothie. That's one, two slices. Now I'll just add some milk. Put the lid back on the blender and turn it on. I can see it mixing, can you? Nearly done. Great, now where's my cup? the lid and a straw. One tropical smoothie. The smoothie costs eight coins. Our customer gave us these coins. Let's count them together. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight coins. What would our next customer like? A watermelon popsicle! Can you help me find the watermelon? We found one half. Now where's the other half? Oh, up here! Let's put the puzzle pieces together. Great! Watermelon! Now let's put it in the puzzle. It goes here. We have a watermelon. Now let's go make that popsicle. First I'll cut a wedge. And now I'll take it to the refrigerator. Pop it inside. Close the door and wait for it to cool down. All done. Now let's take it out. What does it look like? Oh wow! It's a watermelon popsicle. Now let's take it to the counter and serve it up to our customer. The watermelon popsicle costs four coins. Let's count the number of coins our customer gave us. That's one, two, three, four. What would our next customer like? A kiwi ice cream. Can you help me find the kiwi? It's bright green. Here it is. We found it already. Now where's the other half? Ah, over here. Let's put the pieces together. Kiwi. Now where does it go in the puzzle? Up here. That's where it belongs. Great, we have our kiwi. Now let's go to the kitchen and prepare it. I have an ice cream maker. First I need to cut the kiwi in half. Now, I'll just lift this up and put my kiwi slices in here. One and two. I have an ice cream cup and push the ice cream down. I can see it coming out, can you? Oh, look! This ice cream is going to be amazing! All done. Now, it's missing something. Oh, how about a red cherry on top? Looks great. I can't wait to serve it to the customer. This kiwi fruit ice cream costs two coins. A customer gave us one, two coins. What's the next customer want? An apple and apricot pie. Let's go find the apple. Here's the first half. Now where's the second half? Oh, up here, we found it. Now let's put the two pieces together. Apple, can you help me put it back into the puzzle? Great job. We have our apple. Now all we need to do is look for the apricot. Hmm, here it is. And I think the other half is over here. Let's put it together. It fits. Apricot. 
and it belongs right here. We have our two pieces of fruit. Now let's go make that pie. First, I'll cut the apple in half and put it into the pan. That's one, two slices. And next, I'll cut my apricot. That's another two slices. Just put it on top of the toy stove and turn it on. Wriggle it around a bit and mix it with a spatula. And I think I'll just put the lid on. Turn it off. I wonder if it's cooked. I'll just get my blender and mix up the ingredients. Oh, look, it's all mixed up. And I'll just put it into my pie dish. It's all sticky and gooey. Looks great. And now all I need to do is make the pastry on top. I'll just roll it out really flat. And then get my pie cutter and cut a big circle. Great. And take away the extra dough. Now I'll just carefully put it onto the top. And press it down with a fork all the way around. Hmm, I think it needs a decoration. How about I make a couple of leaves? I have a cutter. Oh, looks amazing. That's one leaf. Let's make another one. And we have another leaf. Now I'll just go cook it in the toy oven. Here you go. Close the door and turn it on. All done. Let's go give it to the customer. The pie costs 10 coins. Let's count the coins our customer gave us. That's one, two, three, four coins, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Great counting! Wow, we made so many things today in our toy kitchen! Thanks for helping me! See you next time on Rainy Bow!